up everybody welcome back to another video now I feel like I'm standing on a podium on my porch and this feels great as you guys see I got a fat box right here from Grim Speed I'm super excited to show you guys this let me spit some facts first okay my foot is still broke I mean I'm, I'm kind of limping on it but we out here okay second of all I'm grabbing this sharpie scribbling out my address because you know last time I had some people saying some stuff that they could see my address and stuff on the parts and stuff so you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna scribble this out and stuff there we go anyways guys oh dude we got some big news for you today before we get into that let me just tell you guys I know you all have been waiting for my playlist I have got it all situated I've got it all laid out everything's ready to go the playlist you guys have been waiting for is in the description guys top of the description right below the rivcoshop.com which you could also check out you know cop some merch but we got the playlist on there guys I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for that now let me tell you some things about the playlist real fast old stuff at the top and it gets newer and newer and newer the more you scroll down I don't really have a certain taste in music I enjoy all music okay like I have respect for it all okay so there is different types there's different genres of rap if that makes sense so there's a lot of that in there lots of different stuff in there guys so check it out let me know what you think about it and there we go I'm finally giving you guys my playlist moving on to what I really have to tell you hold on let's go over by the subi yup you already know we putting in work this is the Grim Speed Box. Hello, hold up, hello? Yeah, all right, bet, yeah. Okay, I'll tell him. First, wait, you want me to tell him right now? Oh, should I tell him about the sponsor? Wait, for real? Okay, oh, hold on, I'm gonna tell him right now. Yo, guys, <laughs> I have something to tell you. It's a slight change to the channel, boys. Guys, I just wanna welcome Grim Speed is officially a sponsor of the channel now, guys. This is huge, I'm super excited, guys. Grim Speed, yeah, I just wanna welcome that to the channel. Uh, we got a massive box from them. This is full of goodies. Hold on. Yo, I honestly cannot wait to show you what is in this. So now what's inside this box, I'm not entirely going to show you yet, okay? But we need to prepare. We need to prep the car to install these parts, okay? I should have scribbled that out too. It's okay, you can put a thing on it. What we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to clean this. Look how dirty it is in here. Look how dirty this is. This is uh, just too dusty. I mean, nah, we don't like that. We ain't doing any of this. Hold on. Oh, look at this. Okay. Yup. This needs to get cleaned. We need to detail the engine bay right fast, and then we can get to installing the Grim Speed parts, guys. I believe I have actually made a video on how I detail my engine bay, so I'm not gonna really show you guys or or go in depth about uh, detailing it. Maybe I'll just give you some reminders and stuff. But anyways, what we need to do is we need to detail this right now. I'm actually gonna take off the Grim Speed fender shrouds and then I can clean the Grim Speed fender shrouds separately make them look all nice and then we'll continue with this video boys all right let's go yo whoa guys I just come over to grab my hose and I'm like god what is that that's a fat squash oh my yo we got a garden what Yo, my dad planted these plants on the side of the house, and boy, does he know what he's doing. The Rivco Farmer Shop is open. <laughs> Imagine if I sold his vegetables that he made and everything. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, that thing is long. Okay, yeah, the hose. Let's go. You should just not ask questions. <laughs> Did you just ask me if I put water in the box? No! <laughs> Ready, aim, <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Oh, what am I doing? I forgot to take off my fender shrouds. While River puts on, I mean, takes off. No. Oh, my arm hurts. This is too heavy. Yo, what's up? Let me just explain why I can't say Grim Speed. <laughs> Grim Speed. What? Grim speed. 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 Yeah, I'm explaining why I sound like a freaking retard. I got braces and I don't know how this is gonna work. Yo, what is that called? It's called an expander. I don't know if you can see it, but I got an expander in my mouth because I have no room in my mouth for my teeth. Say Grim speed. Grim speed. <laughs> You know guys, the one thing that I really like about working with Grimspeed is their people are awesome. As I'm emailing and talking to the Grimspeed associates, Sarah and Clinton, guys, totally cool people, way dope people, easy to work with. Like, if you guys order some Grimspeed parts and you know, you ever have any questions, Sophie, good job. I've never seen you work on cars this good. Ah! 
Yeah. Hold on. Yo, put that in the grass. Why? Because I don't want that scratched. You can just go ahead, guys. Email them. They are just customer service is great. Honestly, Grizzpeed, they have a good team. Their team is awesome. Everyone's really nice and easy to work with, guys. Quick responses. Customer service is on point. Grizzpeed is lit. All right, boys. I'm going to finish taking out these fender shrouds. Actually, this one's ready to go. Boom. There we go. So hard. It's just a freaking nut. It's actually pretty light. Just stay away from your battery and stay away from your air box, guys. And then everything else you can spray. Let's go. Might as well just clean the whole car while we're at it. I'm down. Now I grab the magic juice. I swear this is the best degreaser, but I use Simple Green. This is what I use, and I'm always going to use it. It's the best degreaser. No cap. About to degrease the greasy spots. Let's go. All right, can you go give me a toothbrush? Hold up, pause, 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 pause. I'm doing this with a toothbrush. I need some engine cleaning brushes. Yeah, I know. And I also probably should get a little wheel brush too, but we'll do that. All right, everybody, I just sprayed down the engine bay. I got it all nice and clean. Now it's time to dry it, and I have the best way of doing this, and it's gonna be using that thing right there, right there, the shop vac. Now, I don't know if every shop vac has this feature or whatever. You can pull this part off, and it, it actually blows air. It's like a leaf blower. I'm able to dry the engine bay without getting water spots, and this thing works out really amazing. got finished up drying this all out it looks really good already and I'm not even done yet because I like to go through and I like to hit the all black pieces all the rubber hoses anything black with I think I honestly I don't know tire shine tire wet that stuff works too but I think I have some magic black stuff restore stuff over there and I like to use that all in this engine bay and it gets it shining so good but first I'm gonna hurry and clean these fender shrouds real fast so let's get to that and then we'll finish up with the engine bay get those reinstalled in and it'll be looking mint <sighs> Once again, here we go. <laughs> As you guys start doing engine dress up, it's always nice to take the part out and to clean it separately because you don't really want to scratch it. You don't want to... I just sprayed my camera. Careful, River. You just want to make sure you get these really detailed very nicely and be super careful with them. You know what I mean? So I always like to take them out and just do them a little bit separately. Clean them really good. Get them all nice and degreased. Because stuff like this is what pops in your engine bay. And especially if you guys have red pieces or vibrant colored pieces, this is the stuff that pops and this is the stuff that people see. You know, you want to make sure those are extra, extra clean. You want to hit those specifically separate. When people are looking in your engine bay, this is the thing they're going to look at and it's going to be the cleanest object in there so I just go through scrub this whole thing this is actually the first time I've ever cleaned these what am I sitting down yeah. no I'm, I'm sitting on my head honestly guys I do not know how my camera is still standing this thing has been through hell and back honestly I'm not gonna lie I have dropped it I've taken it mudding it's been through detailing cars it's got cleaner on it it's got man that thing it's been everywhere. It's been through everything. Poor little camera. I'm surprised it's still going. But it's still going strong, so shout out to Canon. <laughs> Clean the little end there. Alright, that one's done. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna do the other side. The one thing I hate about detailing my car is my hands are gonna smell, smell like simple green for like the next three days probably. Look how soapy that is. Now that you guys have my playlist, this is what's dope. Because now I can hella talk music with you and this is so cool. But guys, I've been stuck on this Uzi Vert song. One, two, three, four. The fifth song up from the bottom. It is called Strong. Right here. This one is heat. I, I've been stuck on that song like the last week. I keep replaying it and that's the problem with me and music is I find a song and it's so good that I overplay the heck out of it so I always need new music. And uh, and that's why my playlist is so long. I just always try to be finding that new and I always have to scroll all the way to the bottom, go up five songs, click it and play it from there. Um, but with the playlist being new to all you guys, you know, you can probably just start from the top or... Oh, the first song. Oh my gosh, the first song is by Suicide Boys. Once again, get me getting into different genres and stuff. I just got respect for all that stuff because it's all takes talent. It's all just form of art, you know? And I'm just gonna take this, I guess it's 
<laughs> it's turtle wax trim restore. I just like it and honestly tire wet would work the same But I just love taking it to all the black pieces because as you can see it makes everything Shine after I go through the whole engine bay you guys will see what I mean by it, how it makes the whole engine bay look so amazing It just is so worth it. It's so worth it You know <laughs> Okay guys, I got the engine bay finished up. It's all cleaned, ready to go. As you guys see, it looks mint. It's ready for some grim speed parts to be installed in the engine bay. I'm super excited guys. It is getting kind of late. I think I'm actually gonna head out with some buddies. We're gonna go do some stuff for another vlog. We gotta, you know, film two vids one day. I'm gonna start on installing the parts tomorrow, so stay tuned. The video series is gonna be up consistently and quick. I hope to see you guys next time. Peace out.